Y'all, so this is a question out of uh, 3.3. This is question number seven. And it says, a solid gold jewelry box was found underneath the water, underwater palace of Cleopatra just off the shore of Treasure City. If the length of the rectangular box is 26 centimeters less than triple the width, and the perimeter of the box is 288, find the length and the width of Cleopatra's solid gold jewelry box. Okay, so let's take a look what we have here. So number one, y'all, they're telling me that we have a rectangular box, so I'm going to draw a rectangle, okay? And we have two things. We have the width, and we have the length, okay? So let's see. When I start reading, it says the length of the box is 26 centimeters less than triple the width. So I don't know anything about the width. I'm going to call that x. Now, triple the width would be 3x. And then 26 centimeters less would be a minus 26. Okay. So, y'all, if I started to draw on my rectangle, I could say, look, that side is X and that side is X. And that's a 3X minus 26. And right here is also a 3X minus 26. And we also know that the perimeter, y'all, is 288. Okay. So, look, on the next slide, I'm just going to start adding up all the pieces. So, I have an X plus a 3X minus 26 plus another x plus another 3x minus 26 is equal to 288. Okay, so x and 3x is 4, and 1 more is 5, and 3 more is 8. And a minus 26 and another minus 26 should be a minus 52 is equal to 288. So now I'm going to go ahead and add 52 to both sides. Okay, so I end up with 8x is equal to, that should be 340. And now let me go ahead and grab my calculator. Let's clear this out. We got a 340. We're going to divide it by 8. And I'm coming up with 40 and a half. Okay. So when we divide both sides by 8, 42, I'm going to write 42.5. Okay. So let me come back over here to my problem. Okay. So look, y'all, the width we just found to be 42.5. Now, if we want to find the length, we're going to take 3 times 42.5 and then minus 26. So let me take my calculator again. I'm going to take 3 times 42.5 and then I'm going to subtract 26. And I'm coming up with 101 and a half or 101.5. And that's going to be my length. Okay. So we found our width and we found our length. If y'all got any questions, let me know.